There's an uneasy peace here. Both armies with their hackles up. Was blood spilled? No. We took Werum without resistance. These Saxons accompany their lord as we stand beside Guthrum. So this fort is not the sum of his ambitions. Guthrum's plan is to bring the Saxons to the table. If he can win the peace without a fight, he will do so. And how likely is that? Just now they sit on their thumbs in the church, talking in circles. Come, I will take you to him. Who is Guthrum meeting here? Is it Alfred? That's right. The King of the West Saxons has agreed to negotiate. Seems we have him on the back foot. Guthrum should be careful. Alfred speaks with Loki's tongue. Guthrum is not a babe at teat, Eivor. Nor is Alfred. If he has come, it is for his own advantage. Then give us counsel. Stand by Guthrum, show our strength. The King of Hayseeds will soon be humbled, trust me. We took this town as if it were a straw hall. Do not challenge me, Elf King. Your show of swagger and strength has my attention, Guthrum. But we agreed on terms. What more do you want? The crown of Wessex. Wessex has a king, and that king has the backing of the Almighty. Yours is a fever dream, Dane. You have learned nothing since the Danes came here. Guthrum will not bend his knee, Oathbreaker, just as I would not. Ah, Eivor. Our blunted tool returns, Lord. I have given you all I care to. A Dane geld to leave Wareham. You swore an oath upon the cross and that pagan hammer. And when you scurry back to whatever shit-soaked hovel you crawled from, we will release your men. Speak again, handmaid, and I will feed your tongue to Eivor's raven. A fair trade. We already have your cock. Are we done with this pissing contest? If Guthrum has given you his word, then he will honor it. We will leave this town. You have one day. Do not test the King's patience further, or our men will return to Wareham with force. And if you doubt my conviction, know that the Avon River near Uffentune runs red with the blood of your countrymen. Their commander, what did his men cry as he fell? Ula? Uba? Yes, that was it. Remember, you have taken my silver. In return, I expect your honor. I will await news of your retreat in Chippenham. Uba dead? It cannot be. Gods, I will tear that Saxon skin from his bones if this is true. Alfred hisses with a snake tongue, but he gains nothing from this lie. When news of this spreads through the camp, no Saxon will survive the day. You swore upon the cross. Oh, I have no intention of cowing to that milk sack. Now more than ever, I will take his throne and his head. In Winchester, Alfred used me as a tool and cast me aside. So let the betrayer be betrayed. We will burn this village to the ground. After that, we take care of Alfred.
Lord Jesus Christ, help me stand. Leave me standing. Help me stand against the filthy heathens, Dread! Your godson has forsaken you, Saxon. Let vengeance steer your swords. Man. Leave nothing standing! Their prayers go unanswered this day. We should find Soma. Stand firm, all! Do not lose your nerve! This You're place right. is rounded. We leave now. There are forest ruins just east of here, along the road. Come on, men! Move! Actions ahead! Time has come for you! We can rest here a moment. Now, tell me what you know of that breaker of rings. Weak and wretched troll. Alfred is a wily fox. He appears frail, but draws upon an inner strength. He will not be easy to oust. Fury will fuel my army and my claim. It will not be enough. You must find a weakness. Yes. That is why I called you here. Do you balk at the opportunity to bury the Saxon king? I must first hear a plan to balk at. Alfred spoke of Chippenham, a squat hovel of sheep and peasants. So why does he go there, and not to Winchester? Your scouts must know, they're the best in England. A holiday feast, their Saxon Christ mass. Alfred will warm his heels by the fire, while Uba lies cold in an English field. I have called upon my allies to join us in this fight, but I must know where to send them. Is Chippenham our final prize? It is. But uh, I will need my men for the coming fight as well. The hostages Alfred took, if there is a chance to save them? We will not lose more friends today. Where are they held? A place further ahead through this forest. They call it Hampton Blockade. Soma, ride north to the Thames and lead my allies south. They should be gathered by now. I will. Gather on the river passing Chippenham. The rest of you set up camp there. I called you Ravenfeeder once. 
At Porchester, you are as hot-headed as Thor. You have become a true leader, Eivor. As much to come, Guthrum, before we can rest with mead in our hands and songs in our ears. I will crush Alfred's skull with my bare hands if Uba is dead. We cannot dwell on this, even if it's true. If you want the throne, only strategy will deliver it. Or bloody wrath will steal it. I will follow this Alfred, hound his heels. Revenge burns within me. A wise man once told me, we do not dash ourselves against hopeless courses. We arrive unexpected, strike swift. You turn my words against me now, Wolfkist. I took them too hard in my darkest times, my friend. And Sigurd? He is back with you? My brother's story is a long one, and for another time. Ridding the land of a strong ruler will make Wessex harder to tame. You almost sound like you respect him, Eivor. I've come to understand the trials of leadership, Guthrum. It is hard not to cradle something this rat. This is the blockade. The hostages must be in these buildings. What is your plan? It is hard not to. When you cradle something as fragile as life within your hands, you can tread quietly so as not to alert the guards. But I can make this place in moments with my crew. I will follow your lead. I told you, Gothra, would leave us here to rot. Enough skulking!
Gudrun, some of your men. We'll not be feasting in Odin's Hall tonight, boys. You Guthrum's men. Aye, free us and we will fight by your side. Ah, my thanks. Norns with you well. Every Saxon who spat at me will die. You will have your chance, but don't be foolhardy. Let your steps take you far from here to a camp near Tippenham. Thank you, Eivor. You did a great deal. Their families. <laughs> Struck from above. I've seen the Saxons fall upon the enemies this way. Thank you, Eivor. You did a great deed here. Their families will raise a cup to you. Your death is an event, my friend. I need no thanks, Guthrum. Let us speak more when we are safely away. should join your people at the camp. Even a surprise takes preparation. Your bravery? Your leadership, Eivor. You wear it well. You have grown much since last we spoke. You judged me fairly, Guthrum. Harsh, though your words were. But I do not make the same mistake twice. How is your brother, Sigurd? He lives. A changed man. But he is free of full case torment. That at least was a deed well done. Will this all be worth it in the end? Everything we have done? Everything we have sacrificed to win this land? Sometimes I dream of soothed black furrowed earth. And blood seeping from seedlings, poisoning our future. We must believe our way of life will survive. Our fates are woven, but our deeds forge our destiny. Ah, and so to our final battle. We will wait for you at the camp. We must speak. Another matter that needs my attention. I will meet you at the camp. 